So today I have my July favorites for you all, and I'm really excited because who doesn't love to talk about their favorites video, or talk about their favorite things for the month. There we go, we got it, Sarah. But today I am not nude, I am wearing a crop top, I promise. You just can't really see it, but it's I'm wearing clothes. I'm going to be straight up with you guys and let you know that I did not try a bunch of products in the month of July, so you will not be seeing like any beauty products in this video, but bear with me, I'm sure I'll try out a bunch of stuff, especially with back to school season coming up and fun stuff like that. So the first thing I wanted to talk about are these new earrings that I actually got um, just a few days ago, but I've worn them three times and I've had them for three days. So if that gives you any indication of how often I've worn them, it's a lot. But um, these are these Lisi Lurch, Lisi, Lisi, I think is how it's pronounced. Oh my gosh, I'm really an awful person. They're about $90, which is pretty expensive, but I think they're just so cool and unique and such a fun pop in outfits and I love them so much. I think turquoise is a perfect color to add like a statement to your outfit and I just think it's so pretty because it looks good with like so many bright colors and if you wear bright colors like me that's awesome then I have this white beautiful 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 romper <laughs> shocker I actually got from Urban Outfitters I know guys it's crazy right so there's an Urban Outfitters like right across the street from me and this was I think only $20 on their clearance rack and as you can see it's got like the middle like midriff part and it's just this like lace color so I wear sticky boobs with this and you can't see anything through it um, it's very sheer and I got it in a size 2 and it fits perfectly it's from the brand Pins and Needles and it's just like a beautiful like delicate very flirtatious romper and I think it's going to be so fun I've worn it to like just out and about and I think it's so cute so it can be dressed up it can be dressed down and I think that is what is so great about rompers because I ooh, ooh, almost got my lip gloss on it that would have been bad and when I'm feeling really lazy I've been gravitating towards this dress and this is a neon shift dress that I actually purchased from the J. Crew like um, clearance rack and this was like $30 so it was super cheap and it's just this literally neon as bright as it hurts my eyes kind of to look at um, dress and it's pretty long but so it's really conservative it has no shape to it whatsoever which I love about it because you can go out you can eat as much food as you want and no food baby is going to be exposed and it's just really comfortable it's perfect like what I like to think of it as like a travel outfit it's just really comfortable it would be great for plane rides and stuff like that or just like car rides or anything and so I don't know it's really cool it's got like an as techy detail to it and I think it's so cute. So this is currently still on their website, I think. And so I will be linking that in the down bar for you guys. And then the last piece of clothing I'm going to show you guys is this shirt that I actually got from the Southern Shirt Company. And I think this is called the Boardwalk um, Jersey, I think is what it's called. I don't know. It's really great because it's like those spirit jerseys and everything else that you see all over like Pinterest or even on my YouTube channel. But it's better because it's like lighter fabric and so you don't like sweat or anything like that as much and I love the neckline of it because it's just really slouchy and stuff like that so I really like my shirts to run very oversized so I got this in a medium and these already do run pretty large so I don't know it's just so comfortable and I love it so much so I wear it everywhere and I wear it and it covers my shorts and people are like are you naked and I'm like duh are you not naked right now the next thing I have to talk about is this clutch, and this clutch is from Kate Spade. I actually got it on one of their like little flash sales that you get like a huge percentage off. I think this normally retails for around $70, and I got it for $30, and it says, Tequila is not my friend, bacon, eggs, and cheese, please, which I thought was so cute. So I bought this because I was turning 21 right before the sale went up, and I was just like, this is so cute because I can drink tequila legally and I just love it. It's really great. I wore, I used this when I went to, to the ESPYs party, which is the ESPN party thingy, um, and I just got a lot of compliments on it, and I used this for Generation Beauty event thing, and people were like, oh my god, that's so cute, and I'm like, thank you, I love it too. Now moving on to my more random favorites, the first thing I have is my phone case, and this is from the brand Minnie and Elizabeth, and it's actually per personalized. I love it because it reminds me of California, and if I move home on August 2nd, so this place will no longer be the background, which is 
freaking depressing and I just think that this is the cutest case ever. It makes me really happy to look at and it has my name on it so I love it. It's really pretty and white and it's so cute and I love it so I'm just gonna talk on my phone. I feel like I just talked about, didn't I just have favorites like a, a phone case in my last one's favorites? I don't even remember but whatever. So I guess this is kind of random but I have been loving this peanut butter. This stuff is the bomb diggity squared. If you watched my peanut butter challenge with Caitlin and Adubs, um, we did, we tried out every single peanut butter that the peanut butter and co um, like has. And so, um, these are my two favorites. And this one is called White Chocolate Wonderful. I've actually, honestly, I've had a jar. I went through an entire jar of one of these in an entire month. So I don't know if I should be proud of that, but I kind of am. So I love this. This is so good. I'm a huge fan of white chocolate and just peanut butter and white chocolate. Like, need I say more? Like, mm, probably not. So you can get this from like Whole Foods, like Kroger, places like that. So I don't know. I just ordered mine online and then from Walmart.com. It was easiest. So And then I also have the flavor, the bee's knees. And this one actually has a hint of honey to it, which I not. I didn't realize I liked honey as much as I do. Apparently I like it. I don't know. I've never really... I mean, I like honey. I think it smells good, but I never really tried anything like this before. And it's very peanut buttery, but it just has like a little bit of a hint of just the honey to it. So I think that's really, really refreshing. And it tastes so good when you have a peanut butter and banana sandwich. It tastes so yummy. You don't even understand. Another favorite that I've been getting into this month again is Pinterest. I love Pinterest. It's such an addicting thing. So like when I'm just laying in bed, I'm always on it. So if you want to follow me on there, I would love, love, love that. And now moving on to my favorite songs of the month, which is some of your guys' favorite part of this video. So here we go. One of my favorite songs this month was Stay With Me by Sam Smith. I'm sure this is like everybody's favorite song this month. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. My next song of the month is actually a song by Eric Church and it is called Love Your Love The Most. And this song is actually like five or six years old. But like, I just like to add older country songs that I remember listening to like on the radio. I guess that wasn't that long ago, but it seems. But it's called Love Your Love The Most. It's seriously it's so pretty and it just makes me happy because clearly there's love in this world, but your girl doesn't know anything about that because that boyfriend tag was fake, by the way. People didn't seem to pick up on that. So if you're like me and into uh, cheesy country music, it's your favorite, then you'll definitely love this song. So I will link that in the down bar. I also have a favorite YouTuber of the month, and this one goes out to Danny Austin. She is like one of my new best friends, and I've actually hung out with Danny before at like VidCon last year, and I think like playlist a little bit this past year. Barely, it was really like just pictures. We would take pictures, be like, "Oh, how it's going." But then I actually um, stayed in a hotel room with her and Casey and Caitlin uh, for VidCon this year, and seriously, we had so much fun together. She is one of my new favorite people, and. I think you guys will definitely enjoy her videos, so I will link her in the down bar and send some love to Danny because she rocks my socks off and she's cool, so yay. So that about wraps up this July favorites video. I hope you all enjoyed and until next time, I will talk to y'all later. Bye! Wrist, wrist, a little, a little touch of pearls, flip the hair.